The investigation into a fire that destroyed a former flea market in Bradenton. It's a location that's known as a place where the homeless camp out. There's word that there possibly could have been a meth lab on site. ABC 7's Rick Adams has the latest details. Well, this is what's left of the old flea market following a massive fire this past weekend. For the homeless people who have been living in some of the shacks here, they tell us they're lucky to be alive. Oh, my God. I say, thanks God, we say our life. Naomi is someone who is counting her blessings today. She lives with her son and dogs on the grounds where this fire happened. I see the smoke, and I say, oh my God, somebody burned the place. Saturday afternoon's fire spread across many buildings at the site of the former La Mexicana flea market, now a place where more than a dozen homeless people plant themselves. Jessica has lived in one of the shacks for about five months. She says she was in her shack when all of a sudden she heard an explosion. I just threw myself on the ground. I didn't know if, what was going on, if there was a war or what. And then I got up and I opened up the door and I saw these flames shooting out. No one was killed or suffered any injuries. Firefighters say they possibly found a meth lab on the site. Many people who live at this homeless camp tell us they strongly believe it was the meth lab that caused the fire. I know it was because the night before, two people were arguing. They got meth all over this area. This investigation is now in the hands of the state fire marshal. An exact cause of this fire has yet to be determined. Reporting from Bradenton, I'm Rick Adams, ABC7, your Suncoast News.